You're an artist on record, your ultimate intimate conversation with your favorite artist. And who is in the hot seat tonight? This one doesn't get more punk rock than it is, man. Surviving member of the Ramones, we have Richie Ramone. Richie Ramone was in the Ramones from 83 to 87. We're going to talk to him about what he's doing now and what he did back then. Well, if we can get that out of him. But check this out. You're not going to miss it. It all starts now. And remember, subscribe, hit that bell to be notified, and also... In Patreon, we have an all-access backstage pass. And if you want to hang with me and your favorite artist and ask them questions, join the club. Links are in the description down below. Put your hands together now, kids. One, two, three, four. Mr. Richie Ramon. Welcome, everybody. Tonight in the hot seat, we have Richie Ramon. Richie Ramon was in the Ramones from... February 83 until August 87. And then as of 2022, he is one of the four surviving members of the band. Now, the Ramones originally formed in New York City in 1974. And the name the Ramones is pretty funny. They came up with the name from Paul McCartney. Well, Paul McCartney used to check into hotels. That's Paul Ramon, spelled R-A-M-O-N. Dee Dee just took the name Ramones, and then they uh, all called themselves the Ramones. A little trivia here. They're not related. None of them are related. So the band started out with Joey Ramone, who passed away in 2001, Dee Dee Ramone, who passed away in 2002, and you had Johnny Ramone, who passed away in 2004, and original drummer Tommy Ramone, who passed away in 2014. The remaining survivors, members of the Ramones, is bassist CJ Ramone, who replaced Dee Dee in 1989 and stayed with the band until the band broke up and then you had in and out was marky ramon and richie ramon which you're going to meet tonight now richie left the band abruptly in august 1987 after financial conflicts with johnny ramon richie stated that he had asked for a small percentage of the merchandise income based on his time with the band and their use of his name and image which he claimed joey and Didi were in favor of but johnny refused richie said that he never felt entitled to a large share as he was not a founding member but it was about being a part of the band rather than a hired hand and mentioned feeling left out on tours when the other members would go cash their merchandise checks after leaving the ramones richie remained friends with Dee Dee and worked on some of his solo recordings and he was briefly replaced by well elvis ramon clem burke of blondie and the romantics fame hidden up behind us Clem Burke. Clem, nice to have you here. After Elvis played just two gigs, Marky Ramone rejoined the band and stayed until the band broke up in 1996. On March 18, 2002, the original four members and Tommy's replacement on the drums, Marky Ramone, were inducted into the Rock Hall of Fame. Though Joey had died by then, in 2011, the group was awarded a Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award. Hi, I'm Dee Dee Ramone. And uh, I'd like to congratulate myself and thank myself and give myself a big pat on the back. Thank you, Dee Dee. You're very wonderful. I love you. Thank you. And now in the hot seat, we have a six-minute conversation with Richie Ramone. It could be a little under if you're timing it. Don't hold me to it. But here's Richie, and let's see what he has to say. These things in hotels. Yeah. Uh, I come in person because... You know, I'm kind of out here as a way. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Are you on tour right now? Are you home or you're on the Are you home or you're on the road right now? No, I'm you home. You're home. Okay. All right. So we'll talk really. We'll see what we can do the best we can. If not, we could always reschedule when you're in a hotel or something like that. Okay. We could do it in November. I'll be in, you know, South America. Yeah, yeah, we could do something like that. that. But in the meantime, while I got you here, you got new music out, I see, on your website, right? Not Afraid Richie Ramon? Yeah. Is that Ramon, yeah. is that correct? Right? Seven-inch or- seven yeah, yeah. orange vinyl. You got well, it's orange. There were only 300 orange vinyl made collectors. I think those are all gone. I may have a few, but it's basically on black vinyl. But we did 300 on orange. Oh, man. That's cool. That's cool. Now, Richie, I got to go back because 
everybody watching. We met quickly. A Web of Spider show. I played bass for Whitey, Cursed. And you came down there. Okay. Do you remember when you met me or you don't remember? No. No idea. You don't give a shit. But it's okay. Now, let me tell you. what. It's okay. When I played, you gave me your business card with your phone number. I'll call you later. I played with Didi Ramon till he passed away. And Didi always used to want to get in touch with you, but he, you know, well, Didi was Didi. And he would say, what a great right. drummer you are. And it's true because you did a whole West Side Story thing. Incredible, Richie. So I'm here to tell you and kiss your ass a little bit. You are a fantastic drummer. Tell me about, you got the new record out. You've been on the road a lot. How's that been for the meantime? The road is great. It's my favorite place to be because I'm with all my friends and fans I see all over the world, you know. So it's a lot of fun. We just came back from Scotland and Ireland and UK. And it was very uh, pleasurable. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, it's, it's, you know, I don't really play in the States much anymore because it's not thing for me you know they don't really play rock and roll here like you know overseas it's a way bigger deal for me so i have unfortunately i gotta travel far away to get my audience you know that's it's a drag how about argentina have you been there because they love the ramones out there many times oh it was, many it's like times. the beatles that's off the, that's off the hook there so yeah it's a whole nother world. I try to explain it to people. It's like being in the Beatles. It's like mania when you go down there. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, it's the yeah. best feeling in it's the total, world. It's the only place in the world that I have to wear a big nose and sunglasses. Otherwise, I'm spotted immediately as soon as I'm in the airport. So, the only place in the world. It was good for like two minutes. Well, why don't we just do one? All right. Well, that was Richie Ramon. And one, two, three, four. Richie doesn't remember me. I remember him, but his new music is out. Not afraid. Richie Ramon. He has a couple of seven inch orange vinyl labels out there. He could get you. Go to his website. Links will be there. Click on it. Love it. Subscribe to it. In the meantime, everybody. That was a hot second with Richie Ramon. One, two, three, four.